When we moved to Port Elgin in 1988, I went into the library and asked whether there were any book clubs in town, and she said no. That was a very big disappointment to me. And then came a notice a few months later in the newspaper saying that they were forming a Canadian Federation of University club in Port Elgin, Southampton. And I said, there'll be a book club there. <laughs> so I went to the organizational meeting at the, which was held in the Port Elgin Library. And there were 15 women who attended that first meeting. And three days later, I had a phone call and she said the executive is meeting to write the constitution for the new club. But they haven't had very much experience with constitutions and we wondered if you would mind coming just to help us out with writing of the constitution. So I said that I would do that. And when I got there, she said, now, everybody in this room has a place on the executive and every executive position is filled except for president. And they all looked at me. <laughs> <laughs> and that's how I became the first charter president of CFUW Southport. <laughs> we did a lot in our first year. It was, it was quite amazing. We decided that scholarships, which were an important part of CFUW, that we would get together and give out a scholarship. So we, we did, mostly by donation, raise enough money to give out our first scholarship of the year the next fall. And as we got more members and more donations to the scholarship fund. We expanded it to include one $500 scholarship for a university-bound student and one $500 scholarship for a college-bound student. Several years later, we did a third scholarship, and this was another $500 scholarship, for a young woman from the First Nations who was going on either to university or to college. Each meeting we had what we called a hot topic and this was on something that was in the news that that particular month and it was a way of getting our members to know one another because you had five minutes and you had to turn and make a circle of the people who were around you and uh, talk for five minutes about whatever the topic was and then it was over. So it was a really good way of introducing ourselves to one another. We also, that first year, set up some interest groups. We set up book clubs and we set up um, an, an issues group which dealt with policy issues of the day. We set up fun groups too. We had a lunch bunch that met once a month. They're just an, an exceptional group of women to be lucky enough to count as friends. I, I think we're right, at, right on the right path of, of uh, keeping up with our advocacy. Our governments do need some wisdom from other places but their own heads. And, uh, and the belief that you can make a difference if, you're, if you believe in something enough to keep at it. Uh, and, and to get more young women involved in knowing how important they are to the future of our country and to the world.